here with TVG Gaming from the Minnesota Star Charity Tournament, and we're here with who? Caleb Venegas from and Midwest Gaming. Check us out. Weird. And what did you play today? I played Virtual World and I got first place. I was just about to ask that, but all right. Uh, how do you like the deck today? Uh, it was great. I think with all the new cards, it's it's like super insane. There's all right. a lot you can do with a uh, little bit of cards. All right. Anything else you want to say before you get into profile or? Uh, shout out to Walter. He always lends me cards. And uh, again, check us out at Midwest Gaming. All right. Sounds good. 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 Let's get into all it. Right. So I played the uh, pretty standard stuff. Let me go into this one last. But... Uh, three Lulu, three Lao, three Lili, three Gigi, and then I played two Nian and the one two two. Uh, you'll see a little later. I'm not really worried about banishing anything, and uh, you gotta like max out on everything. So. Well, why didn't you max out on Nian then? Well, like this is the only one that doesn't do stuff on its own, and like it's a normal summon or whatever. So uh, just uh, it's not as good. So that's why I didn't do that. And then um, play one of these because it only comes up sometimes. Okay, gotcha. And then hand traps. Uh, I went for nine, I played the three bell, three gamma with the best one, and then the three ash. I thought these were good against mostly everything, so I wanted my main deck to be tuned for anything. Okay. And then spells. Uh, these are actually two prosperity. I don't really like this card in this deck because then you have to play a lot more of the bad cards. So you don't like Desires or you don't like Prosperity? Uh, I don't like Desires. This okay. was Prosperity in the tournament and it was great. Uh, usually if you pros you can Prosperity into combo and then you don't need really need to draw cards off the synchros anyway. So. And you never felt like when you banished off Prosperity you were like missing anything like after you did it or? Uh, no, there's a good amount of flex spots actually and the main combo you want to get to is VFD so it's not yeah. that big of a deal. Um, and then any cards, extra deck cards you banish, you can always shuffle back with Nian too. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Uh, and then I maxed on the Foolish Bail Goods just because you want to be able to see your virtual card because they are good. Yep. And then the three City, the three King Long, and the Itali. They're like extenders because they get your. Or I guess they get your cards going. What do you want? <laughs> and then uh, the three trap cards. So I played the two. Uh, Chuche and then the one new Reborn spell. Super good. Didn't feel like you would need three Chuche for any reason or? Uh, no. So like typically how you get it is either off the gate or you send one and then you can add the spell to activate the second one from your deck. So, yep. and then you can shuffle them back. So two is okay. just fine. Gotcha, and like gotcha. I said, like if you're not playing Desires, it's good to cut down on these because you really don't want to draw them. Yeah, makes sense. And then for the side deck, uh, very generic. I played two nib for the mirror and like whatever else. Uh, three drill, super good right now. Uh, three cycle reader and then the crescendo for Drytron. How do you feel about the crescendo? Uh, it's my first time playing it. It was it was good. I looped it with Shen Shen, so that's kind of broken. Oh, I'm uh, the three Lancia and then back row cards, twin and duster. I was playing Storm before, but like you can discard the spells and anything you want in grave, so. It's also tannable, so you can hit like Schism and Conks and stuff. Yep. So, and then Extra Deck. This is the part that's pretty different. Okay. Uh, I think this was, let's see. I played Coral Dragon, of course, and then uh, Charge Warrior. Yep. Uh, this one comes up a lot more in this deck because I'm also playing Zulkin. Oh. So you can use uh, Coral Dragon with uh, uh, the Lily to make Zulkin and then summon Crystal Wing. Uh, it's a lot easier to make in this deck, and then I like this a lot better than 75 because obviously you negate every turn. So. Yep. Uh, and then I played another six uh, Juju. It didn't come up today, but it's good playing into back row because you can send like torrentials and stuff, and then it can't be uh, destroyed if you've got uh, two of the same in your graveyard. Gotcha, so, gotcha. Uh, I think that's all the sixes. Uh, and then nines, Croc, of course, Shen Shen. Uh, Vermilion and Double Cloud, which is pretty standard. Yep. So, cards are all great. And then for my Xyz, still playing the Bamboozling because uh, it stops hand traps with your Quantities if you can't get to the Zulkin slash Crystal Wing. Yep. Uh, M7, add your good cards back after you use them. Zeus for any of these guys, and then the two Calamities for uh -huh. fun interactive gameplay. Ah uh, yes, fun and interactive indeed. But yeah, so uh, that's the deck.
That's a token right there, I'm guessing? Uh, yes, this All is right, a token. Cool. I'm not a cheater, I promise. All right. Uh, anything else you want to say? Any shout outs? Anything else? Or? Uh, I think I covered most of them, but yeah. All One right. more time. Check us out. Midwest Gaming. Thanks, All for, right. Thanks for the deck profile. Hope to see you do well again. And right. we'll see you next time. And remember, everyone, to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Bye.